Wild one guys are back with another solo car duplication glitch this one's literally easy it's not as easy as the last one so make sure that you are paying attention but it is kind of easy if you do follow it all the way through so make sure that you are watching every single detailed part and if you have any questions add my xbox gamer tag or just go to the comment section and i'll try to reply to as many as you as i possibly can so guys before we get into this glitch massive shout out to this guy right here he actually found one of the words in the previous video so he did win a short card so guys there are still three more short cards to get in this video i will be showing you the third short card there will be a word in this video so make sure you look out for that to have a chance of winning one of the five short cards that i'm doing in this giveaway all you have to do is find the hidden word in this video to get one of the five short cards and then make sure that you're subscribed and send me proof on twitter anyway to get into this glitch make sure that you are in free aim i have shown you how to do this in previous videos just go to story mode go to settings and then make sure that you are in free aim to do this glitch also you will need a garage full of vehicles you can use any vehicles to fill up your garage just make sure you've got a car in there that you don't mind getting rid of as well so if you want to you can get a free leg from legendary motorsport i'm showing you how to do that now just on your phone all you want to do is order it to your your vehicle place where your vehicle is stored so for me my penthouse garage and there you can see i've got an elegy in my garage so that i can get rid of that for this glitch so once you have done all of that all you want to do is get into your vehicle and head over to los santos customs and i'll see you when i'm at los santos customs So once you are at Los Santos Customs with your vehicle that you are going to be duplicating, all you want to do is head inside just with your vehicle and you're going to want to change one thing and then change it back to the original thing. So for me the windows are set as limo so I'm just going to go ahead and change the windows from limo, change them to a different window screen and then change it back to limo and then you can just exit onto the next part of the glitch so i'm just exiting now just back out and all you want to do is go to the same spot that i go to now it doesn't matter if you're not in the exact location just somewhere around here on the side of the road will do and then you want to pull up your phone and accept a job invite from gerald or simeon so just pull up your phone now and accept a job from gerald simeon or martin and then once you're in the lobby all you have to do is wait for the game to start up and then i'll show you what happens from there okay so once the game finally starts up all you want to do is run over to your vehicle now you need to be inside of your vehicle for this to work so you want to head over to your vehicle so i'm just running over to my vehicle now this is what you need to do so make sure you are following these clear steps get into your inside of your vehicle you want to pull up your jobs list and you want to quit the job and disconnect on your console settings at the exact same time as you do this so i just quit the job right there 
and now I'm disconnecting all my console settings. Now when you go back onto the game you should get a pop up saying that the connection has been lost to Xbox Live or to PS4 whatever and it will spawn you back into story mode. Now this is glitched and it won't let you go into online when you're pressing the down arrow to go onto your online character which I will show you. So you're in the clouds now and when you're spawning into story mode go to your console settings and just connect back to the internet before you go into story mode so just before when you're about to go in and now what you want to do is press your down arrow on your wheel and you want to go to your online character select your online character and it will make you go to an online session but it won't actually be able to put you into an online session now you need to repeat this two times so this time and then one more time i will be showing you how to do that so right now as you just saw I pressed my down arrow on my wheel and I was selecting my GTA online character but it won't actually let me go into online. Now this is the part of the glitch that you need. Now you just need to wait to spawn back into story mode after getting this error and then you just need to repeat that again. So the wait in the sky might take a while but it will say joining GTA online in the bottom right and it will actually come up with an error saying that it failed to connect you to Xbox Live or whatever it says. It will come up with an error saying that it can't connect you to GTA Online. If you get this error and you spawn back in story mode, you have done this correct and you can carry on on to the next part of the glitch. So it's this error that you want to be getting, if it does say that it will spawn you back into story mode, it won't actually take you to an online session and that is what you need. So as you can see I'm back onto story mode right now and I'm just going to go ahead and repeat the same thing. I'm going to press down on my bottom arrow and select story mode and it should do the exact same thing. It will say that it's taking me to GTA Online but I will actually get the same error and be spawned back into story mode. That is what you need to do. So I'm just going to go ahead and let it play until you see the error and I'm back into story mode. So there's the error again, just press A on that and then I'll be taken back to story mode. So this time when you are spawned back into GTA story mode, all you want to do is press pause on your menu on your little button on your pad and you want to go over to online and now you want to start up an invite only session so online then this little pop-up will come up press go to gta 5 online and you want to start up an invite only session
So when you are spawned back into GTA 5 online and you're, all, you're in that invite only session, all you want to do is make your way outside of your apartment that you spawn inside of or wherever you spawn inside of or if you spawn outside, you just want to head over to your vehicle. It should spawn next to you, the personal vehicle that you are duplicating. As you can see, I'm outside of my penthouse now. I'm just going to run over to my vehicle as it spawned next to me. I'm just going to go ahead and run over to it. Now you need to head over to Los Santos Custom, so it needs to be the Los Santos Custom that I'm going to now. The one that's in the center of the city, right near the big apartments, all of that. I'll show you right now the apartment that I'm heading over to. So as we drive there, just make sure that you are hitting that like button as it makes more people be able to see this video as there are a lot of fake glitches going around so I want people to be able to see real glitches like this so they can actually make money from these glitches. Also, if you haven't found the words yet, make sure that you're just keeping your eyes open looking for that word for your chance to win a short card so that you got some money to spend on GTA 5 online. Anyway, I'm just going to let it play till I get to Los Santos Customs so that you can find out how to actually duplicate this card. So once you are at Los Santos Customs, the one right in the city centre, all you want to do is go up to the door and as soon as you go inside you want to press pause on your Xbox pad or pause on your PS4 pad and you want to join a friend invite that is it in a different targeting mode and it won't actually put you in the customising mode, it will let you drive around in Los Santos Custom as you can see here. So I just got my friend to send me an invite to there targeting mode their targeting mode is aim assist and i'm in free aim that's why i needed free aim at the start so you will get two pop-ups to come up you're going to press a on the first pop-up then you're going to press b on the second pop-up and there you go guys you have duplicated the vehicle now what you want to do is go ahead and pull up your phone one more time and you want to accept a job from um you want to go to your phone, pull up a job and accept a job from Martin or Gerald again and it won't actually let you join the job. That's how you know that you have done the glitch right. Now all you want to do is head back out of Los Santos Custom, back to your vehicle garage. For me it's the penthouse so I'm just going to go ahead and let it play till I get to the penthouse. So I've arrived at my penthouse finally and now when you go in you're going to get that pop-up saying the garage is full. You're going to press A on that pop-up and there you go guys. Press A on that pop-up making sure that you get rid of a vehicle. Now this is what you needed the LG for or a free car that you want to get rid of. Just tap over the LG and there you go guys. Duplicate a car. Then you can go ahead and sell this vehicle, keep this vehicle, do whatever you want make it loads of money on GTA 5 online. I hope this helped you guys. Make sure to hit that subscribe button and like.